Hey you guys, so check this out. I have a rocking chair. Y'all, I'm super excited about this rocking chair. I've always wanted a rocking chair ever since um, I was pregnant with my daughter. But um, I, I, at the time, you know, my daughter is 11. So 11 years ago, I really couldn't afford one. And then when I could afford one, it was like, hmm, do I really need a rocking chair, honestly? Now, um, I was blessed with the opportunity to be able to purchase a rocking chair. But fun fact, y'all, here's the box. And I'm going to show you guys the receipt. Hold on one second. Okay, y'all, here is the receipt when I purchased this rocking chair. And I just want y'all to focus on that date right there y'all i got this september 11th 2018 y'all check the date today i'll wait yes y'all it's 2020 it's may 2020 this has literally been sitting in the box in my basement for two years two years and I'm just now deciding to get it and I put it together just now by myself um, you know I consider myself pretty handy I did put my daughter's crib together by myself um, so I knew this wouldn't be hard for me to do um, took me about i say about a half an hour if that um but yeah this is how much i paid y'all two years ago it was originally priced at 93 dollars and 29 cent but um i got it on sale for 23 dollars and 32 cent and the reason being is because um, my local grocery store, they purchased, they had all this summer furniture that didn't sell. And when it doesn't sell, it does go to like 80 to 90% off. And that's when I snagged it, y'all. So I'm actually putting this in my room. I don't have space for it really in my room. But my, and actually let me walk in the kitchen, y'all, just to talk. Because my nephew's on the couch sleep and I don't want to wake him up y'all can see that it is pretty late but um what i'm thinking is i'm gonna put it in my room i don't have space for it really in my room but i like to be in my room sometimes but i don't like to always sit on my bed or lay on my bed because that makes me tired i like to sit upright but i also have back issues so i like to lean back and this is gonna be perfect hopefully y'all it don't fall apart I had a few issues here and there but for $23 if it lasts me a year I'll be happy with that um, so yeah you guys I love it let me know what you guys think alright you guys look what we have here I just put together my fire pit super super exciting it was really easy the assembly was really easy four steps all you need is a screwdriver and basically all you're doing is putting together the legs and that little circle piece holding the legs together but yep here's the top cute little mesh top and then it has this um i don't even know what to call it the thing i guess that you sit the wood on top of and then it has the wood like poker thing i don't know the correct terms I literally just bought this to um to do s'mores with but will probably be you know it'll be nice to sit around with um y'all can see all the plastic and stuff that I'm about to clean up right now don't know if I showed you guys this you can't really tell what it is again I got it from Amazon and they didn't have any type of packaging anything like that but this is just the um cover 
that goes to this because I do plan on leaving this outside throughout the whole summer. And just like my grill, I'm not bringing my grill in and outside. And actually, let me show y'all because it's pouring raining right now. And I hope that y'all will be able to see my grill with the grill cover. You can't really see. But my grill is out there and that, that's the grill cover. Um, but yeah, and it's pouring rain in. <laughs> so we leave that out there throughout the whole summer and just cover it with the grill cover. And that way, you know, it protects it from the rain and things like that because we do have a chrome top grill and I don't want it to rust so that is that situation but it's going to be the same exact thing with this i don't want it to rust but i am keeping it out all summer and so with that being said i bought a girl a cover for it and when it's not in use it will be covered so yeah i think we're gonna um use this tomorrow it's gonna be a very cool day like today it was damn near 90 degrees but then tomorrow's gonna literally drop to like 65 degrees and so we will probably make s'mores on this tomorrow i don't know don't quote me yet if we do or when we do first time i will vlog it for sure um but yes super super exciting and um basically what i plan to do with all of my new summer items that i have because again I don't um, have um, like all this stuff that I'm getting for the summertime I never had before and it's dark outside it is currently 11 o'clock so it's dark outside you probably will not be able to see it this is my backyard you guys I'm trying to turn my light on oh yeah you can see it okay so right back there that thing and as you can see it is pouring um but right back there that white um shed back there we've never used it but we're gonna start using it this year because i'm not bringing in and out stuff you know what i mean so in my shed i'm going to keep that when um the season is over i'm gonna keep that in there i'm gonna put my grill in there i am gonna put y'all yeah, just purchased a lawnmower because i'm sick of waiting on people to cut my grass hence why my yard looks like that now waiting on people so i just purchased my own lawnmower that's gonna go in there we're not in use so yeah awesome i just want to show you guys that stay tuned